welcome welcome back to my youtube channel my name is kxp okufa you can call me whichever one of the two you like and i run the youtube lifestyle channel that you clicked on so today um as you can see from the title we're going to be doing uh, a shopping haul so we're going to be unpacking and speaking unpacking the stuff i got and fun fact i bought everything from one shop it was completely coincidental it wasn't planned but we'll be unpacking the stuff together so do stay tuned so if it's your first time stopping by and you have not clicked on the subscribe button i suggest you do and you become the last one of our family we would love to have you here and bear in mind it's absolutely free. so i think one thing that i really genuinely wanted and where we'll start off is this i really for the longest time wanted an orange dress because i got orange and brown shoes so i needed a dress to go with it and this type of dress i really wanted it for a long time it's just the one that i got is a bit different from the one that i had in my head so i got this orange dress let me show you so the material as you can see is a bit shiny but if you've checked um people that are wearing zara and Shein, this this material, like the shiny, kind of yummy, gooey material has been on trend. So the dress is basically, it's basically a button down. Dress. This one's a bit different from the initial one that I wanted because this one has a cutout. I just thought this cutout was just going to be like a small, slim, nyana cutout. No, it's actually kind of really huge. So I feel for me, because I really haven't toned my body to what I wanted to become, um, you'd probably wear it with the top inside so i'm going to insert images of the dress that i initially wanted and then the dress i got okay so this is the dress one like i mentioned i'm such a big fan of orange and these are the shoes my aunt gave me so i finally have shoes to match the dress i think it's cute for lunch dinner or like a date or something or you can even like dress it down with sneakers and take it to group with you i did mention something about the cutout I'm not really comfortable with those at the present moment because I haven't really toned my body to what I want it to be. But I think you could always wear an orange top inside or um, a, a white one or a black one. But um, my roommate and I discovered it's kind of see-through material so you need to be really wary when it comes to underwear. But the material feels really nice, really light on the skin. It's work. Okay, so I'm thinking, but yeah, this is basically the I dress. I didn't speak on the shop that I got everything from. It's the shop called Blondie's Collection ZW. So she has really nice stuff at really affordable prices. Um, I think you either join the WhatsApp group or the Instagram group. But even if you're not in any one of these groups, if you follow her, you probably get really nice stuff for really affordable prices. So she also advertised a different type of orange dress on a page. But when I got there, they were out of orange. And I already have a nude dress. So I figured, why not um, get a white one? And I think my sister and my mom will be really happy and pleased to find out that I'm wearing more dresses. So like I said, I will insert a picture of what the dress is supposed to look like on a mannequin and then at the end i'll also have a video of me trying on the clothes so this is basically the dress um it's white right um um yeah it's below the length is below your knees right above no below your knees right so this is the the whole thing extract, <laughs> and then you crisscross them like so and then you pin them at the back so it's really great for church um, for a wedding, if it's a different color, because I'm not really a fan of wearing white to someone else's wedding. I feel as if the center of attention should be the bride. And really, wedding rules that you Zimbabweans don't follow is that the bride is the only one who's supposed to be in white. But I think it's a nice, it's a good length. It's a very respectable length. It gives you that I'm classy, but I'm not trying too hard. I'm not trying too hard to be sexy, but I'm still sexy. I advise you wear this with black underwear. Or no underwear at all because I, I, it's white and it's some silk satin material. So you don't want people seeing anything down there. So this was the second dress that I got. And fun fact, these are all the same price. Okay, so this is the dress I was talking about, the one that's um, below your knees. Um, I think it really gives you like um, classy vibes, you get angelic vibes. Like I was saying, it's great for a wedding. So you, uh, she had nude and orange, but orange had sold out. But do you get how you feel? I feel like really classy and elegant and super angelic. So since that other dress won't be able to cut it for church, like not at all, I think this would be good for church. This would be really good. For like I mentioned, um, you could pair it with anything because it's white. Right now I'm wearing colorless um, 
slippers i mean colorless heels right so you could wear transparent heels or you could add a bit of color but i like how it looks i like the elegance. um i understand mine is creased at the moment but just be sure to steam it i'm not so sure about ironing because the material seems really fragile but just steam it so yes i think so far fun fact this is my favorite i like it i really like it a lot so i don't really buy winter clothes because my mother doesn't believe in that she believes winter is the shortest season in zimbabwe and you're not supposed to splurge but yeah you could just get a few winter items so i got um a winter woolen dress i wanted to wear this dress with boots i will show you the boots i wanted to wear the dress with but i got there they had run out of the boots and the boots that were there were not in my size and the other ones that were there i wasn't really feeling them so i just got a bodycon dress uh it's wool really really thick so i think um, when i tried it on it was actually super super hot you can see um, the material stretches my only worry with this dress is richard dump like um this dress really nice combat boots um a nice gold chunky necklace your hair tied up in a bun and lipstick red lipstick you would look absolutely fire but i can't find the boots i've got everything except the boots so i'm working on the boots so this was the other dress that i got so so far this whole seems to this clothing haul just seems to be dresses upon dresses upon dresses but i've got you so what i have here is something that i didn't actually want to buy myself in my hand is something that i initially did not want to buy but when i went i went with my friend his name is leo he's like get it it's so nice and 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 i wasn't really sold on it so it's a romper i hope you can see so this is a romper um it's got flared bottoms it's scotch and it's got two belts but because of the shape of the belt you're supposed to the shape of the bodice sorry you're going to have to wear a t-shirt or another top inside of it primarily a white one and then i believe in red lipstick you wear red lipstick and you get out but fun fact it actually is really body it hugs your body really nicely and for all the big girls she's got big sizes this was not even the biggest size this was i think are two sizes away from the bigger size so you've got enough space for your thighs your hips your bum she's got you covered really so this is the romper that i got um i wore it last night actually because we went out a lot of people were like oh it's so nice it's so nice but can i com be completely honest i really wasn't feeling this this is something that I, I bought out of peer pressure but so far so good try out a romper i think it's it's weird it's like what is she wearing but in a good way do you get it yeah um so this is the other dress the black one uh i'm shocked like the last dress i wore to kudzi's birthday lunch it significantly got shorter after i wore it my roommate claims i'm delusional and ranch won't go to dress the full beard, but i'm shocked so i think wearing it with heels would be i don't know yes you can probably a nice black pair of heels or i think you can get away with sneakers but i mentioned before it's super super thick it's actually super super hot um because some uh, winter hasn't really started but i think this is versatile throw on a biker jacket imagine this dress in boots like i kept on saying like those combat boots biker jacket chunky necklace you'll be looking fire or you could do heels or air force ones but generally this dress yo do you know why i bought this dress i thought it was going to be good for church and whatnot but clearly not i can't go anywhere like this so it significantly got shorter after i wore it but like i mentioned the material is thick and i'm actually super super hot so let me change into the next one so next we've got on the romper the leotard i don't really know as i mentioned before it's really figure hugging and then it flares at the bottom on these slippers with the big base and you could also do sneakers and i've got on um a white t-shirt inside you could always wear okay um rumi behind the camera my roommate claims this t-shirt is cream so for the purpose of this video we're going to refer it as a cream t-shirt right and then you could also wear green or like the beige color that's on it but it feels really comfortable it's nice it's just i don't know about this romper i've got like mixed feelings about it but yeah so far so good like i mentioned fits like a glove so yeah so the last item we've got is this pink tracksuit so i remember when we were growing up we used to wear tracksuits 
all the time and i think tracksuits are back in fashion there's a really popular south african influencer her name is mbadi i saw her rocking a pink tracksuit as well so i was like ooh, baby girl is on trend and i think she's a singer her name is tapsi she was also rocking a pink tracksuit so i have it's a pink two-piece tracksuit and it's short sleeve it's got a really nice fleece material it's really oh like it just makes you want to snuggle it um so i actually have pictures when i was wearing this pink tracksuit because i wore it i think two days ago right but the issue with this tracksuit is regardless of the fact that the material is like fleece like and whatnot and you'd expect it to be thick it's actually not thick at all so um you, if you're gonna you can't wear the track jacket like just zip it up and then work out absolutely not you've got to have a top inside and then for the bottoms um for the bottoms and um, we're back to our underwear issue it's either you wear black underwear you wear leggings not even the half masks the biker tights no don't do biker tights because you can see through them probably full length leggings or you don't wear any underwear at all the way that's another option so this is basically the tracksuit um the pants fit really really well you don't have that just the v thing going on there no they fit perfectly and so far so good i like the feel of the material really if i'm being completely honest it's what drew me to the tracksuit and it feels really really nice but this tracksuit specifically i didn't get it from blondie i got it from another shop that is within the mall or the complex that she has her shop in i hope that made sense i really hope that made sense i pray it made sense all right so yeah okay so last but not least we've got the pink tracksuit i'm wearing it with sneakers you know me i really love sneakers and i'm super comfortable in sneakers so my sneakers also have pink so they complement the tracksuit so like i mentioned before the tracksuit feels really really nice and you've got to wear something inside um, again, like my roommate said, I'm wearing my green t-shirt because it's not white. I'm wearing my green t-shirt, but you could always wear it with a white t-shirt. I did mention I've seen influencers like Bali and Tapsi wear pink tracksuit as well. So we're on trend. And I'll show you a few pictures of when I wore the tracksuit on a different day. Um, like I mentioned before, just be wary about underwear. But apart from that, the material feels really, really great on the skin. So I would really advise you to get it it's on trend but um in terms of preparing for winter as we're going into winter i don't think this is the best winter outfit it's more like this period where we're transitioning into winter not the warmest but um yeah. tell me in the comment section which one is your favorite outfit and if you made it this far into the video thank you again and if you haven't subscribed please click on the subscribe button and become the last one of our family i promise you i assure you it's absolutely free